everyone and welcome back to Little Books Great Stories. I hope you all had an amazing Christmas. Today we're going to read How to Catch a Snowman. Christmas may be over, but snowy season isn't. So I'm going to keep this information in mind the next time I find a snowman. And also, legend has it that if you are subscribed to Little Books Great Stories and you like this video right now, then you will surely be successful in trying to catch a snowman. Okay, let's start reading. How to Catch a Snowman by Adam Wallace and Andy Elkerton When the moon is full on a snowy night, something magical happens if the time is right. It's not an old silk hat that brings me to life, but the enchanted snow star shining down at midnight. I don't thumpity thump or give warm hugs. That's for my friends to do. These clever kids will try to trap me. But who will catch me? You? That first trap was a good attempt. Your running made me smile. Your net of scarves might have done the trick, but it's left you all in a pile. Now this trap is an improvement, and my escape is no guarantee. But I'll skate fast, and with a spin, you're covered in snow like me. A snowman who loves summer? I've heard of this before. What you didn't know is I can fly. Stand back and watch me soar. Chasing me down the hillside, you're really good at skiing. But when I bounce into a snowball, I'm really good at fleeing. I have to admit, that trap you made was a clever use of snow. But I can see that it's a trick. It's time for me to go! A snowman shop? That's quite a treat. Made special just for me. Perhaps I'll grab a hat or scarf. Or maybe two or three. You built me with a carrot nose. I think that's kind of cute. But cuter still is trying to catch me with vegetables and fruit. This winter wonderland is great, so bright and full of fun. But snow globes can't hold me for long. Too bad, I've got to run. Woohoo! Your sleigh ride sure is fun. I love gliding down this slide. But I think I'll skip the trampoline. That ends with this jolly joy ride. Now that was one fantastic trap and very well thought through. Nice try. Well done. Magnificent job. But I'll still escape from you. Once I've escaped your final trap, you get called in for dinner. As the sun sets, it seems to me that I am the contest winner. You tried so hard to catch me. I'm glad I'm free. It's true. But perhaps before I'm on my way, I can leave a gift for you. Thank you so much for listening to today's Read Aloud here at Little Books Great Stories. Please come back again next week for more here at Little Books Great Stories. Bye!